Hello, I'm Beverly from the Midland Public Library Program Assistant, and today on Know Your Local Species, we are going to learn more about cicadas. Cicadas are large, sound-producing insects, best known for their multi-year life cycles. They are true bugs. Scientists know more than 3,200 species of cicada worldwide. In Canada, scientists have recorded 21 species found in forested areas across the country as far as the Northwest Territories. The loud, distinctive call of males are heard on warm summer days and are unique to each species. Cicada species are either annual or periodical depending on their life cycle. While annual species are seen each year, periodical species emerge in 13 to 17 year cycles. Only annual species of cicada are found in Canada. Cicadas are large insects, approximately 25 to 50 milliliters long, with wide set eyes and short antennae. Most of North American annual species are black with a greenish or orangish markings. Cicadas have long, sturdy beaks that extend backwards beneath the body used to pierce roots and twigs to consume sap. Nymphs live underground and resemble wingless brownish adults with large shovel-like front legs for digging through the soil. Cicadas are found around the world, mainly in forests and grasslands. Although one species, the Canadian cicada, is found in the Northwest Territories. In Eastern Canada, the most commonly encountered species is the common dog day cicada. Cicadas have unusually long life cycles for insects ranging from 2 to 17 years. They spend most of their lives underground as juveniles. Adults only live for about a month, just long enough to mate and lay eggs. Adult male cicadas sing from, from treetops on warm summer days to attract females. Females cut into living or dead twigs of trees where they lay their eggs. Eggs hatch about four to six weeks or else during the following spring. The tiny nymphs fall to the ground, burrow into the soil and begin sucking sap from the root of the tree and other woody plants. Freshly hatched nymphs only a few millimeters in length but will spend several years feeding and growing until they reach adult size. Nymphs molt their exoskeletons four times before they emerge from the soil, climb up a tree or another object and molt one more time into the adult stage. Their molting exoskeletons can often be found still clinging to trees in mid-summer. Most cicadas are so-called annual species, referring to the fact that at least some individuals merge each summer. This is what a cicada sounds like. Cicadas produce sound by vibrating a pair of structures called timbals found on the upper side of the body behind the wings. It's like a tiny pair of drums using rapid muscle contraction. Cicadas are herbivores, insects that feed on sap of their host plants, most of which are trees and wild grasses. Adults feed from twigs while nymphs feed from roots. Although the impact on the host plant is generally low, the feeding activity among larger broods of periodical cicadas, which we don't have here in Canada, can reduce the growth of the affected tree by up to 30%. I hope you have enjoyed this Know Your Local Species, and I hope you get into the library soon to enjoy some resources that we have here. Bye for now.